Greetings, friends. Welcome to today's Family Altar Audio Devotional. Our scripture reading today comes to us from the book of Proverbs, chapter 20, verse 1. And the quote is by William Marion Branham from the message entitled, Life. This message was preached on June the 2nd, 1957. We hope that you are blessed today as you listen. Wine is a mocker, strong drink is raging, and whosoever is deceived thereby is not wise. A few weeks ago over at a great famous hotel in in Canada where they had put me up, I went up to my room after my service and there were young ladies, perhaps in their late teens, 18, 19, maybe up to 23 somewhere, three or four of them running up and down the floor with just their underneath garments on and with bottles in their hands, running from one room to the other, lovely looking young women. As I got off the elevator, I stood and looked. Oh, there was something in me. I thought, oh, God, will my little Rebecca or Sarah ever come to that? And I looked at them. They staggered across the floor. I just stepped into one side of the pass, walked on out, went the other way, drinking. I stopped in the hall, looked down again, seen lovely little ladies, which could probably be a real sweetheart to some man. And I heard one of them say, whoopee, this is life. I thought, how wrong that is. That's death. For the Bible said, she that liveth in pleasure is dead while she is alive. So then we find out that life, what we call life, and we see signs today such as this. Where there is Budweiser, there is life. How perverted that is. Where there is Budweiser, it is death. And we see signs like this too. Life begins when the sun goes down. No death begins when the sun goes down. The people become night prowlers. They prowl at night. And if you notice, they take the nature of the evil. Evil always prowls at night. And I read an article in a magazine one time when I was on an airplane. And it's about Hollywood. And it said that life begins after midnight. You should come down on certain streets and certain things. And they had the picture of burlesque and so forth that goes on. And I said, how perverted that is. You see, if Satan has a kingdom, he's got to have a false economy. He's got to have something that he can present to them to make them think they are living. But it's absolutely on the vice versa side. It's death in the form of life. See, it's a perversion from real life. Because let us settle this in our minds now, once and forever. There's only one way to have life. That's right. And to know Him is life. That's the only way that we can have life and no other way. For God has only promised life through Jesus Christ. And the great Jehovah without beginning or without ending, without, without beginning of days or ending of years has given us life through Jesus Christ and Him alone. We trust that you have been blessed by God's Word today. The devotional you just heard was derived from Brother Tim Dodd's Family Altar devotional book. If you are interested in a copy of your own, you can visit store.bibleway.org to order your own copy. If you would like to listen to more daily Family Altar audio devotionals and other spiritual message-related content that we produce, we invite you to subscribe to the 10,000 Worlds podcast or visit us on YouTube, Facebook, and on our website at 10kworlds.com. That's the number 10, the letter K, and the word worlds.com. If you feel that this ministry has been a blessing to you, 
and you would like to support us financially to help us deliver more and better content to you in the future, you may easily do so by clicking the Consider Supporting Us link in the description of this episode or visiting our website to learn more. It's okay if you can't support us financially, but would you do us a favor? Pray for us and share this episode with others so that they might be blessed as well. Lastly, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell button so that you get notified when we publish more content like this. Thank you, and God bless you.